And well, like I said that uh, we get to the latest on Cyclone Fengal that is all set to make a landfall and particularly the states of Andhra Pradesh and Tamil Nadu that will see its impact. Now, heavy to very heavy rainfall that has been predicted by the Indian Meteorological Department and the next 48 hours that are particularly crucial. Let's give you a sense of uh, how the cyclone is turning out and what its impact largely on the states of uh, Tamil Nadu and uh, Andhra are, but before that, we focus on the cities of Chennai and Puducherry. So primarily in Chennai, like you see, the traffic is significantly slowed down due to the accumulation of ankle deep water, especially in the low lying areas that we see, uh, which are affected. Fishermen have been barred from going to the sea due to high waves and this is the precaution that is always given. Uh, Chennai airport is temporarily shut down and uh, flights have also been suspended as of today. Indigo and several other airlines that have taken a hit because of that. Public transport has been suspended along the crucial east coast that is the Mahabadipuram road. So this particular area that uh, is lined across uh, the, the coastline, I beg your pardon, has uh, seen a complete stoppage of movement. 500 plus coastal families that have been evacuated and more than 2200 relief camps that have been set up in Chennai in order to ensure that there is minimal damage and those uh, who do suffer from its impact can receive immediate help. Let's now shift our focus to the city of Puducherry where restrictions again have been established in Marina Beach in Patina Pakam and Edward Elliott Beach. So these two beaches that are very frequently visited, uh, there is no movement absolutely. More than 300 police personnel who have been de deployed across the coastal roads to ensure that all these restrictions are followed. And there is significant loss for paddy farmers in Kaveri region due to heavy rains, uh, which again uh, will have its impact in the time to come. But uh, right now, uh, they're just ensuring that the damage is minimal. Uh, schools, of course, have been closed and five areas that are the low-lying uh, areas in Puducherry where a red alert uh, has been flagged and people have been asked to stay indoors. Like I said, low-lying areas that have particularly been evacuated. We'll now show you the cyclone tracker of how it was uh, moving from the Bay of Bengal. And this is the movement so far, as you see that the cyclone has made its way. And now uh, in Tamil Nadu that it is making a landfall. So particularly today and tomorrow, like I said, heavy to very heavy rainfall that has been predicted and people have been asked to stay indoors. Uh, any sort of public movement uh, that has been restricted at the moment and evacuations also from all low lying areas. Let's now take a look at uh, these ground reports that have been fired by my colleague Aneri, who gives us a sense of how the situation is turning out in Puducherry. Take a look. Well, as we are right now at Rock Beach in Puducherry, where you can see that uh, heavy winds and rough sea right behind me. This is the Rock Beach where you can see the Cyclone Fingal, uh, which has been uh, now making its impact. And also at the same time, uh, high tides being witnessed, well, not only in Puducherry, but also uh, the Mahabalipuram and other coastal region of uh, Tamil Nadu also has been witnessing uh, heavy rainfall and also at the same time we have been seeing that how uh, there has been a red alert which has been issued in uh, uh, southern Andhra Pradesh that's the Rail Sima region in Tamil Nadu. Uh, Chennai also has been witnessing wa uh, water logging like situation there um, and also now as you can see how there has been a rough sea, high tides and also uh, heavy rains which have been uh, taking place since last of many hours now and also now the Med Department officials uh, say that the cyclone fingal which was expected to make a landfall in at around 5 30 now it is going to take some more time uh, so uh, in within few hours from now uh, the cyclone fingal will be making its landfall between mahabalipuram and puducherry but yes uh, ndrf teams sdrf teams have also been deployed at various locations where a cyclone fingal is uh, likely to have its impact and also at the same time there are helpline numbers helpline centers which have been um, uh, 
uh, issued by the authorities here and also the fishermen have been asked not to venture out in the sea uh, so that no untoward situation takes place and also there are gusty winds uh, which have been uh, moving at the speed of near about 70 to 80 uh, kilometers per hour and also as the uh, landfall uh, may, uh, as the cyclone Pingal comes closer to the coast then uh, the winds are also expected to go up to 90 kilometers per hour so definitely uh, we'll have to see how uh, and what would be the impact of cyclone Fingal uh, uh, in in coming few hours from now well, right now as we are in Puducherry where you can see that cyclone uh, Fengal will have most of its impact here in Puducherry between Mahabalipuram and Puducherry and as you can see how uh, the sea is rough high tides and also um, uh, winds blowing at the speed of 70 to 80 uh, kilometers per hour and it is likely to go up to 90 kilometers per hour but also as you can see rough sea and that is the reason why uh, authorities have ensured that fishermen shouldn't venture in the sea and also um, um, or there are officials which have been deployed here to make sure that no one ventures out near the sea as this is a tourist spot and also at the same time the chief minister has also reviewed the situation he is closely monitoring the situation here in Puducherry as um, uh, the IMDA officials have um, said that this um, uh, cyclone Fengal will have most of its impact uh, between uh, Puducherry and um, uh, Mahabalipuram well as you can see ma um, heavy to very heavy rainfall and also at the same time red alert has also been issued in many of the districts in Tamil Nadu Puducherry and also in the Rail Sima region of Andhra Pradesh, a red, a red alert has been issued and also at the same time we have been seeing uh, that this being one of the tourist spot here um, uh, as tourists visit in large number. Now as of now due to cyclone Fengal, um, heavy rains we, which have been witnessed in the last 24 hours, people have been um, asked not to come into this area and also uh, fishermen have been asked not to venture in the sea whereas as we also see that the schools and colleges um, have been shut uh, to make sure that uh, the, basically uh, to further safety and precautionary measures schools and colleges have been shut there are helpline numbers which have been issued uh, so we'll have to see how it turns out to be but as cyclone Fengal is expected to make its landfall at around 5 30 uh, in the evening today uh, and what would be the impact that is the reason why we also see NDRF and SDRF teams also put on standby here in Puducherry and other areas which uh, it is going to be affected. This is Anirisha with Bridge Journalist Channel for Republic TV. And we now shift our 